Hey, what's up guys? John from JohnMcNeil.com here and I was currently in my email and I thought that this would be a good opportunity to actually do some training in terms of email deliverability. As you guys know, it's getting harder and harder to get your emails into the inbox and if you're going into that spam box, then your emails aren't getting read. Of course, you're not getting any clicks and you're not making sales. So it's vitally important that you get into the inbox. So I wanted to show you guys two different ways that you can actually check to see if your email is passing like the spam checker so that you know that the likelihood of it entering into the inbox is very high. So I'm actually, I have Aweber, so we're just gonna jump right into it. So I have Aweber and Aweber now has this feature where you can actually check your spam score. So I actually just created this email here and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna check the spam score. And don't worry guys, I wanna show you guys another way that you can check your spam score without having Aweber. So if you have like GetResponse or another autoresponder, don't worry, I'm gonna show you that in a second. So with Aweber, if you do have it, once you type up your email, you have it in your drafts folder, you can go ahead and click on spam score and then it would actually bring up a score of, you know, for here it says zero and it says any score below five is okay to send. So basically this is showing that I have a good spam score and more than likely it's going to actually get in the inbox. Now, if I don't have Aweber, what do I do? So essentially you can go over to this website here called mail-tester.com, mail-tester.com. And so what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna grab your email. So say I'm gonna copy and paste my email here. If I can grab it, let me see if I can grab it here. There we go, copy and paste it. Then I'm gonna go over to my Gmail and just paste it in here really quickly. I'm gonna put my subject line. Um, personal so that was my subject line and then i'm going to go ahead and just copy this email address you're going to email it to this email address i don't know how the science behind it but it works so i'm going to paste it in there and then i'm just going to hit send and then i go back to here and then i'm going to click on then check your score so I'm gonna click on that and then it does a little bit of propagating and it takes about 15 seconds, but it's gonna check the email that you just sent. Of course, I don't know how it actually grabs your email, but you'll see that it, it does. And then it kind of gives you information in regards to if it's a good email to send out or not. So it says, wow, perfect, you can send this. The score is 9.9 .9 out of 10. And then it actually kind of gives you, so this is my subject line, some personal advice, right? So you know it pulled from the exact email. And then it kind of gives you some stats here. It says click to see your message here, spam assassin, things you can improve. So you can kind of click on that and you know read about like maybe something that you can improve very easily or quickly within the email. And then the only other yellow one was here where it says, you know, check whether your message is well formatted. I think it's formatted pretty well because I went back to format it. And it says I'm not blacklisted, there's no broken links. So of course, you know, I got a score of 9.9 .9 out of 10. So this is something that you guys can do every time before you actually send out an email. A lot of emails, as you guys know, are going to the junk or the promotions uh, box and it's a problem, right? So this is just something that will take you two minutes to do just to kind of make sure that you are gonna hit the inbox. And then if you're not, if, if you're getting like a two out of 10, then you probably need to go back in and retweak your email, reformat it, make sure the links are working or take out some words and kind of adjust it so that you're actually hitting the mailbox. So I hope this information helped. If this was helpful to you and you like more information, more tips about email marketing and things that you can do to kind of build your affiliate marketing business make sure you hit that like button and let me know in the comment section that this was a cool video and you like more tips and tricks like this for your affiliate marketing business so i hope you enjoyed it make sure you grab my ebook on how to get consistent buyers to your affiliate marketing funnel make sure you grab that in the description below and i'll see you guys in the next video peace